went to Bath and Fellow, Nick and I are having a little romantic getaway to celebrate Valentine's Day. So we've decided to book ourselves into an eco cabin here um, on this beautiful buffalo farm just outside George. And the cabin is absolutely gorgeous. We've just arrived. So come and have a look at our view for the next day. Okay, so as you walk in, it is just absolutely stunning. Uh, this is the kitchen area, little lounge, dining room area. But I think not only is the beautiful decoration uh, that catches your eye, but the view. So the minute you walk in, you see these sliding doors that open up onto um, a dam and this just magnificent view of the dam and the animals. So we'll come and take a look at the animals. So we've got this big balcony where we're going to bry tonight. We've got a bry area. Um, and so Nick's going to bry. <laughs> And then we've got like a pool and this we call a donkey because you warm the pool up with uh, by making fire so you put it in you make like a fire in the pit there and then it warms the water and it's going to be like a, a spa a mini jacuzzi but um if you can see in the distance you can see a couple of uh, horses there's loads of buffalo and where are they there are two fat lazy rhinos having a sleep on the lawn so that is our view for this evening okay, so this is uh the first room i'll call it the guest room the baby room um it's also got a beautiful view it's got two beds um the decor is really modern really um chic in here also with its own bathroom and shower um yeah so this room is actually going to be empty unfortunately and then come and take a look at the main room so our room for tonight is this room over here. Furniture, everything, everything has just got such a good touch. It's really nice. Um, but it also has this beautiful bathtub. Um, I love these old bathtubs. And apparently there's an outdoor shower that I haven't had a look at yet. Okay, so just over this wall here where the windmill is going, there's actually a chicken coop. And you can go and, not a coop, coop, and you can go and take your own eggs in the morning for breakfast free eggs isn't that cool i can't see over the wall i'm too short So as Jenny was saying, uh, we are now at Buffett Fellow and uh, well, the place is lovely. I love it. It's great and it's super simple. I really, I'm, I'm impressed by this kind of build. Uh, it's basically 240 feet uh, uh, containers put together. Uh, it was built and designed very smart, and, but also it's not an expensive build. So this is awesome for that. Um, tomorrow morning, we're going to try to walk around. Get our cars, go see the animals a bit closer. So there's some rhinos, which I'm excited about because we don't see rhinos a lot. Otherwise, a lot of buffaloes. I think they have zebras, a um, bunch of bucks. This could be great. It's going to be awesome. Uh, if we do have a little bit of time, we might try to go on the kayaks and the canoes on the little pound there and try to get closer to them. Uh, that'd be great. Uh, they also have fishing rods there. I hate fishing, but why not, you know? Um, my god i'm really red today played some golf today it was awesome but really really red um otherwise uh definitely gonna enjoy a few drinks in the in a little spa and uh well, let's see where it goes okay we've got the fire going and hopefully our little pool will warm up soon so that we can have a little romantic dip in the pool um and have a glass of bowls it's the water warm of hot water and cold water. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. Well, could be a little warmer. It'll be perfect for you. Perfect for me. Yeah. It's because you know I like to have things very hot. <laughs> so there's like patches of cold and. Do we have any friends here? Not yet. So if you want to make a Canadian man happy, it's fairly easy. Fireplace, fire in your living room, the smell is perfect. And then add a few candles and the ladies could be happy. Amazing, amazing way to finish your night. And maybe a beer or two, but 
you know, that's always making me happy. Did you check if we uh, had any eggs today? Oh, there you go. Lost a hat. Alright, super cold this morning. I think it's gonna warm up. Really, really nice day. So before we go, we're gonna do what they call the breakfast rain Run. game or whatever. <laughs> I don't know what they call this, but basically they're giving us champagne and breakfast, and we're gonna go see the animals in the truck. So, and uh, we need to check if we have free eggs. Why would you be scared? Jump out of here. No, they didn't jump out. Oh, no eggs. Oh yes! Here's some eggs! <laughs> oh my gosh! We got some breakfast! <laughs> Three eggs! Should I take them? Yeah. They're free range eggs. Nice to meet you. <laughs> what is your name? Jennifer. Jennifer? Nick. 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 Thank you, Peter. Oh. Thank <laughs> you. 
Give the big one one, and then you can try the small one. He was for five years by us in Joburg. Really? In, in our garden. Yeah, and I was trying for the small one. What's the wire? Okay. Come by then. He's still a little bit scared. Throw him, uh, maybe I throw him. Ha, 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 ha.